We're going to play a game, so you're all going to play, so everybody can stand up. Now you're standing. If you think, oh no, you can do the next bit. If you think that what we say is impossible, sit down. And if you think it's possible, stay standing. Okay? So, you can read with your eyes closed. Impossible sitting here. Sit down. All right. Here's the next one. You can eat all your dinner. Is with your... Oh, eat all your dinner. Yep, you can eat all your dinner. Is that possible or impossible? Are you all... I'm hoping it's possible. <laughs> now, impossible or possible? All right. You can lick your elbow. Okay, give it a go. Can you lick your... Is this possible or impossible? <laughs> I'm hoping no one can do that. You've got some joint issues. Can't lick your elbow. All right, number four. You can teach a goldfish to play the piano. Oh, Ben, I'd like to see it. <laughs> All right. Don't prove me wrong. <laughs> you can brush your teeth before bed. Possible or impossible? Possible. You can fly by yourself without any equipment. Impossible. You can fly by yourself without any equipment. No. <laughs> um, you can be in more than one place at a time. <laughs> Didn't think of that. Oh. And last one, you can have a baby when you are a hundred or older. Or really, really old. <laughs> <laughs> all right, you can all sit back down. In today's Bible reading from Genesis 21, we're going to listen to Bernard and he's going to talk about God's promises for Abraham. And one of those promises is that Sarah would have a baby. Now, today, it's impossible for ladies to have a baby when they're really, really, really old. And back in Abraham's day, it was also something that was impossible, that didn't happen. But you know what? Nothing is impossible to God when he makes a promise. He always keeps that promise. He made the impossible possible. And Abraham's wife, Sarah, had a baby when she was really, really old because God had made a promise that Abraham would have a child. And even though it didn't happen when Abraham thought it should or would, it did happen. And God did not forget and he kept his promise even when it looked impossible. So we're going to pray. Dear God... Thank you that you always keep your promises. Please help us to stay faithful when things don't seem to go our way. We thank you. You are powerful and can do the impossible. In Jesus' name, amen.